It's home for a week. It is home for a week. Uh, all right, look at this. Wow, dang. So we got off the crappy turnpike and got back on 95. So uh, this is much better, wide open. So uh, we're still an hour and a half, 88 miles. It's like the exact same distance on this way versus that road that we'd have to pay on for no reason. So I mean, it doesn't look like rain, but we're actually getting rain on the windshield, which I don't think you can see, but I promise it's raining. Another uh, another stop with waiting. I think there's a guy over here about to pull out, but yeah, we're good. We can go to this one now. All right, so we're not that far. We just need a little boost. So let's charge up. Oh yeah. All right, let's go into Wawa. Hey, look, it's the first ever superchargers to have trash cans. The superchargers never have trash cans, but because these are at a Wawa, they've got trash cans. Is this our free? No. We can get free coffee if you need it. <laughs> well, it's exactly like the other one was. Sunglasses. She lost her sunglasses already. I don't, I don't see any of these that you would care for. <laughs> Wait, here we go. Yeah, of these. Yeah, you think so? I've never seen such a thing. All right, we're back. Supercharging stations cleared up a bit and almost to Miami. All right, so we're only 38 minutes, 30 miles away from our parking location in Miami. So there we go, 95 south to Miami. Finally down to 23 minutes, 15 miles. So close. Ooh, wow. So fast. There's no speed limit in Miami if you didn't know. One of my, oh like, my gosh. square and long. It's like your dream. And it's on water. It's like a whole shopping mall. It's like and a public. Nicest, best buy I've ever seen. <laughs> All right, looks like we're here. This is where we're gonna park. And our hotel's like right over here somewhere. It's, it's only like a half mile walk. This whole ocean drive is closed. So that makes things a little complicated. But that's our parking deck, hopefully. I don't know what person designed this parking garage, but to put this concrete thing in between in the curves is like a terrible idea. All right, we're waiting to park. We're waiting to park. Wow, there's supercharger. There we are. Kind of a repeat of Rick, Rick Flair's event, if you saw that video before it was taken down. That was a bit of an experience. It took like seven minutes to get through this garage. But look at this. We're like literally right where it says Miami South Beach. Oh, dang it. Right where it says Miami South Beach is like where we are so we're like in the heart of it you ready my queen no she's she's still worn out from coyote ugly mm -hmm. we gotta find one here get a coyote ugly here let's go this is always nice don't know if it's free we're about to find out oh man how does miami have a broken elevator you would think that would be like on point and fixed in a day at least, maybe it'll be fixed before we come back in a week. Well, leave in a week. Is this, keep going down? It's dark down. <laughs> a bike repair station. That's pretty cool. Yeah, we gotta go this way. We're here, my queen. She's she's still out of it from Coyote Ugly. <laughs> ah, so that's how they close the street. <laughs> hey, there's the ice cream place. So that's how they close the road off, okay. Nice. Thing, my In a way, we're technically oceanfront because our hotel's over here and the beach is just right there, but you can't really see it from here, but it's oceanfront in a way. All the trees, it looks way different here. Well, not way different, but it's, it looks different. Yeah, everybody likes bikes, I guess. All right, up here on the left should be our hotel. 
14th Street. Like restrooms and stuff, nice. Winter Heaven. That place seems like a big party. Marriott Vacation Club. Ocean Drive Miami Beach. All right, now we're at our hotel. It's the, the teal and orange, I guess. It's kind of teal. This is it though. We're here. We're here. This is us. So I guess it's these two buildings? Because it says check-ins over here. Oh, well, that's tall Paul. Everybody talk about him in the group. Oh, we're here. We're here. Oh, yeah. I like this little lounge area. All right, we'll check in and then we'll get up to our room. What'd you find, my queen? Oh, water. Coffee, hot water, nice. They even got your sweetened stuff. Thanks, too. We do get beach towels. Drop off your beach towels here. This even has flight information. <laughs> All right, so there's two buildings. We're on this side, and uh, this side's locked 24 hours a day. I like that. Like, you gotta have a key to get in here. Whoa, tiny elevator. It's so little. <laughs> All right, we're at level two. Yeah, I've never, never been in an elevator this small. <laughs> What's our room number? 2204. So that's 2200. So we're down here on the side. No view for us. I didn't think we'd have one. It's very nice in here, I gotta say. I'm digging it. It's home for a week. It is home for a week. Oh. Uh, look at the little, whatchamacallit there? Plant? It's not a real plant, but. All right, look at this. Wow, dang. So we do have an adjoining room over here if we had, you know, if we want to throw a big party in Miami. Wow. All right, let's cut some lights on. Do a room tour. <sighs> Time to relax. Yeah, home for a week. AC unit's on the wall. Let's get that way lower than 74. 74 is like hot for Miami. So this seems to be our kitchen area. Of course, there's never any light switches. Like there's a light here, but where are the light switches? Is it? There we go, found light switches. But very nice. So this is our kitchen area. We got a full fridge. Oh yeah, oh yeah. This is a real ice bucket. Like, you can actually fit ice in that. <laughs> this is probably one of the nicest microwaves I've ever seen. Got a little flat top here to cook on. What's underneath? Oh yeah, all the pots and pans, trash, etc. Is this a... It is, that's a dishwasher, wow. Look at how fancy they did these. I don't know what any of this is, but. Coffee machine, coffee stuff, toaster, knives, even got paper towels. What's up here? Cups, okay, okay. And plates, bowls. I think that's it for the kitchen. Did I show you this? So look at this, complimentary Wi-Fi, the valet parking, the beach club, not too bad. Complimentary towels, cleaning services, don't care for that. Security, don't smoke and don't care about that. Yeah, don't care about none of the rest of it. The jacuzzi's open from 7 a.m. to 10 p.m., fourth floor of each building. We gotta check out the jacuzzi, my queen. Yeah. I'm digging the whole style. Telephone information and rates. Phone, little picture. I guess we can just close these. You know, there's nothing to see out there. I like that chair. That's like a boss's chair. Does that move? No, I yeah. thought so. All right. We even have three seats here. All right, what do we got? What do we got in here? Is this a, uh, yeah. It's kind of what I thought I'd see. A little cleaning stuff, ironing board, iron, and even for your laundry. Oh, that opens? I didn't notice that. Hold on. We got the TV. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is like a 50, 50, 50 to 55 inch dish network. All right. Ooh. Ah. So it seems like, yeah, it seems like four people could stay here. Two in the room and three, maybe five. Oh, it is a pullout. Okay. All right, cool. Then there's a fourth chair there. I didn't even notice that. You like the stairway picture, Michael? Yeah, a lot. I do like that. You do the honors. Open the cool doors. Uh, <laughs> do we got a light switch in here? Over here. Oh, um, there we go. We got a little fan. So this is the king room. Very nice. Light, phone, power and USBs. Oh, we even have a TV in here. Nice. These are like a mirror. Yeah, soft clothes. What about this side? Yeah. I don't know why I'm fascinated with soft clothes stuff. 
There we go. Got the uh, alarm clock, which alarms off. That's good. And then power and USBs. Dear guess, bed sheets that are washed daily and done. Okay. Very nice in here. What do we what do we got in this closet? Does this go into? No. There's our safe. Our safe. Luggage rack. No. Closet. Breaker box. And does this lead into the? Oh, it does. So you can go that way or this way into the living to the bathroom. Very nice. There. Whoa, look at that. Hell yeah. I like that. Very nice. So our typical not enough conditioner, shampoo, body wash, and body lotion. There we go. Now they're both on. So very nice sink. Look at all this down here. What's this? There's a hair dryer. All the nice folded towels. Anything in here? No, nothing in there. More towels and everything else you need. Nice. Dig the mirror. Oh. Can't see you. There you are. <laughs> Just a toilet. Nice picture again. Look at that. So fancy. And then the best part a shower. A very nice opening shower. You can like take that off the wall and use it and everything. It's not the widest in the world, but it's pretty good. I can't complain. Close this. Well, I think that's it for our room tour, McLean. Do you want to hit Miami? Mm -hmm. I think that was a halfway no. <laughs> it's a yeah. All right, let's go hit Miami. Very nice. But first, we gotta go to the fourth floor to check out the hot tub. This must be like the suite. Thank you. This is where the hot tub is. Man, everything is. There we go. Yeah. Oh, whoa. Dang. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow, this is nice. So you can. Lay out over here. Are these connected? No, they're not. And then right over there is Miami Beach. Look at that. That's that's pretty nice. I guess I gotta test the water. See if it's see how hot it is. Yeah. Oh wow, yeah, that's pretty hot. Yeah. This is this is pretty nice. And this is open to like 9 p.m., 10 p.m. So A whole little eating area here with USBs and power. I like it over here, and we're away from all the people. I dig that. ATM snacks, gotta love snacks. How much are they? Let's see. How much is 307 MMs? What do you think? What are your predictions? 250. 250? I'm going with five dollars. Wow, you were right on the money. 250. Hell yeah. And uh, ice machine that's always helpful. I used to love burn notice too. Now on the watch episode. This. Yeah, 301. Yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah. And this way is just the first level of rooms. I like this walkway though, with like the thing that's not. I think it is. I think this is a business office where you can work, borrow a computer, etc. Borrow books. Okay. All right, out to the beach. This is like right outside the door. Whole little chilling area on each side. Hilton's Grand Vacation. And yeah, the check-ins over there. All right. Whoa, they got a video doorbell. <laughs> so nice out here. What'd you find, what'd you find? Oh, I just the walkway. Um, there when we were standing up the top. I was curious Let's go put our feet in the sand uh, in Miami for the first time. Oh yeah. Morning. <laughs> yeah. 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 Like it's like paradise. I like they got security everywhere too. There's like cameras all over the place. Yeah, I feel safe right here. Yeah. So this is our this is our actual this is the actual hotel that we're staying in. Both sides. We're on the left side, second floor. The Art Deco district. Alright, so they got all these little paths and you walk to one of those to get to the beach. Don't know what's up with that. Yeah, that's a Starbucks. <laughs> I like these walkways. Very nice. No alcohol. No alcohol either. That's what it says. Wow. They just put this all the way down to the beach. <laughs> wow. I must say, yeah, I expected it to be. Maybe it's because it's Sunday. But yeah, I was expecting it to be packed. I wasn't yeah, expecting anything. 
Yeah, let me kick these off, I guess, too. Here we are, my queen. Cabanas are 500 each. Cabanas are 500, umbrellas are 200, lounge chairs are 400. This sand feels a little different. This is Miami, my queen. We're here. I wonder what those blocked off things are. I think they're for the turtles. Yeah, that's a sea turtle nest. Wow. Yeah, lots of seaweed. At least, wow, yeah, this whole section. All the way down it is a ton of seaweed. Wow. Interesting. Fancy. So we picked this place for dinner. We was kind of checking out the menu, but then they had pizza and was gonna probably order Domino's anyway, so it just kind of made sense to get pizza here. But we might get something else. I don't really, I don't know yet. Alaskan king crab, one pound, 50 bucks. So it's uh, dinner time. We picked this restaurant, which is a couple down the street from our hotel. And like, we're right on a time. In my bathing suit. <laughs> we got a fancy little tablecloth thingy here. Yeah. Paper straws. I hate paper straws. But other than that, it's good. And that's yellow. She likes yellow. She likes yellow. Yellow. Alright, food is here. This is the pizza. I'm not trying to eat a ton tonight. I'm gonna split it with my queen. Who's having a salad? There's even a restroom and a shower up here. I think we're gonna enjoy the hot tub a little. While wow, there's uh, still this concert going on over here. So this is our hotel at nighttime, all lit up. And, uh, and then the rest of Ocean Drive. Alright, we going, my queen? Yeah. Let's go. That's the place we had lunch and dinner at tonight. Looks nice. Lit up at night time. This is what you do out here. Fresh cold drinks. You just uh, walk the strip. Tons of places to eat. We're trying to find like ice cream now. It's really so different out here. They all have the menus for the restaurants. So like the menus right there, you can read it, see the price and then go in or not go in. Definitely different. This is the alley. This is pretty cool. Whoa, there's like words on it. Yeah, see? The alley. That looks really nice. Oh. That's funny. I'm thinking so. So it was just put up in 2016. This thing ain't even that old. Yeah. But very cool. It's a little shortcut to our hotel over here. There's a haagen and a Sbarro's right there. The Starbucks. Plan to have that in the morning. And there's an entire cigar store. And a uh, bit of a difference. It's died down out here. I think it's about nine o'clock. Eight to nine o'clock. Nine ten. Nine ten. So it is nine o'clock. But still, great place to be. So apparently, the beach closes at ten p.m. Crazy, I know, but uh, we're gonna check out the beach before it closes because we know we have at least 50 minutes. Wow, it looks way brighter in my camera than it actually is. But yeah, this is Miami Beach at night. It's black, but you can't tell it in my phone. The little part I guess I should add in is on the front porches you're not supposed to smoke. So back through here, I'll go through this door. And look at this, we got fishies. Well, we can't see any of them. There they are. There's the fishies. Yeah, this has fish in it. 
I like it. And, and then you've got this nice little smoke area over here. And uh, seats, ashtray thingy, trash can, little lounge area, neon lights. It looks nicer at night. Looks way nicer at night. I don't know what's through here. Nothing. Okay. Hello, beautiful. <laughs> a little bit of our review of this place. We loved it. Mm -hmm. Number one thing about it is security. If you're in this building, which is the McAlphin building, you are completely locked in the whole time. You have to use a key card to ever get in this building. Main Ocean Drive one next door, two separate buildings. Uh, that one is open during the day and then by like 5.30, you have to use a card to get in there as well. You have to use it to get up the elevator even one floor. So I loved, loved the security. There is also, uh, I don't think I showed it, but there's a washer and dryer uh, up on the fourth floor here out by that hot tub area so if you need to wash your clothes you have that they also have the coffee downstairs and water and stuff in the lobby for free every day and also you can uh, rent out towels for going down to the beach you just sign them out they'll give you towels and then you return them. tons of good things about this place really no complaints I did look up the rooms this uh, queen room that we're in, we only had the queen size bed, is uh, I believe it was $511 per night. So I can tell you, we did not pay $4,000 to stay here for a week because we're Hilton Grand's vacation owners. Technically it cost us 80 bucks, but very expensive if you wanna stay here. But also you're right on Ocean Drive. I mean, you walk out and mm -hmm. you've got everything there. So the staff though was really friendly. I think the room was super clean and uh, really I can't have any complaints probably besides the fact that they don't have their own parking, but I don't think a single hotel here has their own parking. So I can't really knock them for that. I just, I personally dislike that. Yeah, me too. <laughs> That's our review of the Hilton Grand's vacation in Miami. Absolute amazing, two thumbs up. Now I'll do it for this one. We'll see you in the next one. Click like, click subscribe, indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. We'll see you next time. Deuces. Bye.